Welcome back. Beers Watch Brew Review. Jerry and it, Jacob. Window on the camera. We are in Greensboro, North Carolina at Steel Hands Brewing. And we've been to the one, ironically, in Casey, near Close Columbia, Columbia, South Carolina. We checked that one out, done a review on that. This Up is Natty Green's older brewing spot. Yes, I think it was there, and then they shut down mid pandemic. It was Natty Green's second brewing yeah. spot. They still have the one in downtown, but I mean, overall, this place, this is it. you know, might be one of the best breweries in Greensboro yeah. right now. It's got, you walk in, you hit the kind merch. of merch area slash check in. You can order. The cool thing about this place is you can order your beers, your food, your whatever at two different multiple locations and it all covers your tab. And then you walk through, you see the big open kitchen that's you can look through and then you've got what? There's bathrooms there on the left. Mm -hmm. Bathrooms are stocked for the ladies and with a changing table. Yeah, men's were nice, plenty of areas. And then it opens up yourself. into the huge tap room. Yep. Yeah, high tops, low tops. They've got a stage for performers. They had live music coming up as we were leaving. Very open. You know, 18 to 20 beers on tap. So they've the got, new one releases every Wednesday. And then they've got outside seating. I mean, just about everything you want. Parking seems to be a little questionable. As we're sitting here, I look up and I see an additional parking sign. So maybe there's more. So that might be the only thing that kind of knocks it for it. But I mean, it really, the beer we've tried, I had a flight, tried all the IPAs. Um, I did a sweet tea lager, had a little lemon slice on top, real cute. Very good, very easy drinking and still at like 5.6%, which is crazy. And then I had the sour as well. Great. Yeah, I did, like I said, a flight with all the I, IPAs and then I had a, a pint of the oh so hazy, I think. IPA to finish it off. All their beers were good. Nothing blew me away. Stuff I tasted before, but still overall atmosphere. I mean, just with the inside, the outside, staff was great. Food was good. We had a pretzel mm -hmm. and nine dollars for the pretzel includes your mustard and your marinara. Two dollars more, you get the beer cheese. You know, beggars can't be choosers. You pick your own there, but and then they've got pizza on their menu. They've got yeah. calzone. So more of that quick bite kind of pizza in there. But you just, they've almost got it all. And as I said from the beginning, it, it might be the best brewery spot here in Greensboro. I mean, I'd come back again. Yeah. So. It's right across from the Coliseum. So if you yep. have a concert or a sporting event, it's walking literally across the street. Yes. I mean, park over there. If you want to tailgate over here, come drink some good craft beer. Then go drink your cheap stuff over across the way. Why not? Or again, if you're here for a Wiggles concert or something, I don't know, a kid's <laughs> thing, you come over here and then go over there, at least get you a little buzz before you got to watch Disney on Ice or something. I don't know. <laughs> I think we've covered it all. Let's get to the scoring. Ladies mm. first. I thought you were going to go first. I mean, I can go first. You I'm go first. I mean, I'm in the 4.7. Okay, okay, okay. I was going to go 4.6. 4.6. All right. You brew it. We review it. Like, comment, subscribe. Till next time.